Hi you guys, welcome back to another vlog. I'm so excited for this vlog. I'm packing right now to go to Oregon for the first time. We're gonna be staying in Lake Oswego and I'm so excited. I've never been there before, so I'm just excited to be there and bring you guys along with me and vlog the whole entire trip. I can't wait to see what it looks like and see what we're gonna get up to. I know we're gonna be doing a bunch of fun things, so I'm very excited. Make sure you're subscribed. To the channel so you don't miss out on any future videos also follow me on instagram and all of that and i'm so excited because this vlog is actually sponsored by best buy so thank you guys so much for sponsoring this video i am so excited because i got a brand new camera and i'm just so excited and so grateful this is an amazing camera it shoots in 4k and it is the canon eos r50 rf s18 to 45 millimeters f 4.5 to 6.3 ISSTN lens kit and i love this camera so much i've been playing around with it for the past couple of days since i got it and this camera is a mirrorless camera with the flexibility of interchangeable lenses and it shoots in 4k it's amazing quality perfect for vlogging because you can take out the screen and have a little viewfinder for when you're filming and I love how it's super easy to just zoom in and out and I'm really excited the quality of this camera is just amazing and I'm so excited for my future vlogs because I feel like they are just going to be such great quality and it really is a upgrade so if you guys are interested I will link it down below you can shop it on bestbuy.com they have really fast shipping also you have the ability to pick it up in stores if you're interested and they also have a price match guarantee so i will link it down below in the description and thank you so much best buy for sponsoring this video and sending me this new canon i'm so excited to vlog with it and i'm just really excited to upgrade my content so check it out link will be down below and uh, let's get on into the vlog We just got out of our sweaty, sweaty workout at Yoga 6. We took a sculpt class and now we're getting coffee. I like love this little town where we are right now. We're in Lake Oswego. And it's so cute. It reminds me of like a little fairy tale town. And I don't even know how to describe it. It just has like the best energy. It's very light. The air is like crisp right now. It's not cold, but it's like crisp and cool. You know what I mean? Crisp. <laughs> There's my sister in law in the wild. Nicest person in the entire world. Right there. <laughs> Where are we? Chase, where you at? <laughs> Frank. It's hard to get a picture. Frank. Frank, can you sit? sit. Look up here. Look Say hello. <laughs> ah, <laughs> he's beautiful. Thanks. <laughs> he's a Ginger oh, line. Wow. From you can just <laughs> feel the good energy going down. Cure, from Cure. <laughs> <laughs> oh. It's spicy. But it's good. It was spicy. Yeah. <laughs> it was spicy. But yummy. I showered and kind of got ready for the day. My hair's already almost dry from sitting out in the sun. We were just sitting out there for a little bit and figuring out what we're going to do for lunch because we have a podcast to record in an hour and guess who's going to be on the podcast. Mac is coming on the show today and I'm so excited because I feel like just, I mean, I don't know. I feel like he's never had like a moment to talk about 
um, and I mean really anything like he's in my vlog. He's not in my vlog hey you guys. And I feel like he, to introduce him to Just like social media. I'm always so private with my relationships. I get like scared Because like you know when people say like when you post your relationship and then like people can like wish bad energy on you And stuff like that like I always get freaked out. I like to keep like my relationships private But Mac agreed to do the podcast and I feel like that's better than being like on camera and on video But we're going um, out to get some lunch before you record I'm really excited for you guys hear that episode by the time you see this vlog I think the episode comes out next Tuesday today is August eighth i believe and the podcast will be out next tuesday but anyway we're going to get some lunch i think we're going to go to zupan's which is my favorite little grocery store here that we went to it yesterday but i love it it reminds me of air one and i just threw on a little sweater from abercrombie and then my bikini is frankie's bikinis and i'm wearing these linen shorts from park <laughs> Delish. We went to Lola's instead uh, of the grocery. I got a salad and a matcha, and it's so good. Guys, now we're at Zupan's. We didn't go for lunch. We ended up going to Lola's, obviously. But I'm so excited. It's like Air One, and it's so good. Oh. Em and I are getting dinner ready. We're doing taco night, so we have some salsa verde, mango salsa, pico, sour cream, lettuce, and then I have the guac over here. And we also have some carnitas that we just cooked with Mexican seasoning, and they smell so good. And I'm just making a couple of quesadillas right now to have on the side, and we're just using these tortillas right here, which are literally the best tortillas this brand and then just a little bit of cheese. We just got back from coffee. We went to, we ended up going to this place called Morris oh in the beginning, but we all got different coffee. So we got to try. I got Mac this one. I And then we ended up going somewhere else. So I got him another. I got him two options because I don't know if we didn't like the coffee there. I don't think he's going to like it. And he's really funny and like specific with his coffee. So I got him two, but we went to Zupan's which is like the place that reminds me of air one and i got a iced dirty chai one shot of espresso with almond milk and it's really good i like it a lot but i've been really into warm coffees lately and i saw margot lee post a tiktok it came up on my tiktok this morning so i think she just posted it today and she was drinking she made a coffee at home and it was like with this smeg coffee machine and it's like a one touch coffee machine i guess there's like a bunch of buttons on the top you can pick like how the size of your coffee and you put the beans in the top and you just press it and it makes like the most perfect looking hot coffee and i was like i really want that because i feel like i can't i don't know what the coffee machine that i have the breville i just feel like sometimes i just want like a cup of hot coffee in the morning i don't want to make like a latte and that's what that machine is for and i miss my old one what was that old one that i had the breville like nespresso one yeah. and chase has it right now but that one was like the pods and i just didn't really like the taste of the pod and i really want to get that coffee machine but um yeah anyway we're on like the coffee talk right now i got him a hot latte with a shot of vanilla and then this one is a mocha ice mocha then my little haul from zupans we have the cocoyo peach nectarine this looked so good i've never seen this before so i got that and then also got some of this almond milk coconut cream coffee and then we got some breakfast burritos this is 
pot bacon breakfast burrito. So I got two of these. I just ordered some coffee on, honestly, on like an app. It's really cool. I don't know why I don't do stuff like that more at home because I ordered coffee and straws and creamer and- And this sis is over here eating some tortilla chips. I'm gonna make this coffee. I follow this girl on Instagram and she is the owner of Daily Drills. Yeah. And she makes this really good coffee and she puts this in it. This is why mm. I bought this one. We don't have this on the East Coast. Mm -hmm. The Harmless Harvest with Pulp. So I'm gonna add this into my coffee that I'm gonna make. Okay. And then we're gonna do cold brew. I got two of them. Because I don't know. I feel like although when you're on vacation, like it's nice to go out for coffee. I'm There's just like home. such a person where I love making it at home. Even though I, I talked about the coffee earlier today. I'm gonna add some of this Calfia almond milk creamer. And then we're gonna top it off with Harmless Harvest coconut water with pulp. And this is what she does. And it's like, I guess like a coconut. I think I added too much. It's a coconut cold brew. I'm gonna do a taste test. Okay, that's good. I like that a lot. dinner we got a salt and straw I keep wanting to call it salt and stone because that's the deodorant that I use but I got strawberry with the waffle cone and it's so good and we went to bamboo for dinner and we got sushi and we're in that little town from yesterday morning that we went to and this is where we got juices <laughs> but it's so good and it's so cute here. Good morning from this cute little Starbucks. Guys, this Starbucks looks like it should be in a movie. Like I keep saying this about this town, but it's just like everything here is so cute and just looks like a fairy tale. But we're getting coffee this morning from Starbucks. I got two coffees. Guys, my little little toy. Um, I got a grande pike roast hot coffee and then I also got a venti cold brew because I don't know sometimes I just like their cold brew I'm gonna add milk in it at home Portland lacks in the coffee department yeah I agree I definitely agree that I we have like been trying to try different coffee places and I just don't really have one that I'm like, oh my god, I need to go there every yeah. single day and get a coffee. Guys, I think we found our coffee spot after Lola. we literally just said we didn't like Lola. the coffee bolas, which I, I forgot they have really good matcha latte, which I had the other day. The matcha was really good, but I got a uh, ice latte with almond milk and cinnamon. It's fire, fire. Wait, can I try it actually? Oh my god, this is bomb. Best coffee okay, so in Lake Oswego is bolas. Okay, this coffee's amazing. I got the Lola breakfast plate, which is you get to pick what type of eggs you want, and then it comes with like a sweet potato, onion, potato thing on the side. Bacon, which looks so crispy and yummy. I got a side of avocado, toast, and they give you a homemade jam and some butter. It looks so yummy. And then I also got this banana bread, which they warmed up. I'm so excited about the banana bread. I haven't had banana bread in so long. Remember your era when you would just make so much banana bread? Yum. Guys, winery time. <laughs> we have this sprinter that just got here that's gonna bring us to the winery. Where should I sit across from you? You ready?
the morning. We just got to Lola's for breakfast again. I tried the avocado toast this morning, and Emma got the coconut yogurt bowl, and it looks so good. And Lexi also I got. Mine's like ruined. <laughs> Lexi also got the toast, and I sauteed with almond milk. We just finished up a really good Pilates class.